What's up, Grinders? Grinder Games back with Twilight Struggle. I am playing through an entire game, and I am currently on turn two. The U.S. has two victory points, uh, but that's okay. We can uh, hopefully overcome. We'll find out. We'll see what kind of cards we get. Round two. Here we go. Turn two. Still in early war. Defcon's at five. That's good and bad. All right, so the headline phase. Let's see what we have. I have two scoring cards. This is problematic. As you can't hold on to them, you have to play them. So let's see. Let's see what we have for scoring. By the way, I apologize. These playthrough videos are a little long. Um, they tend to be around 30 minutes. I understand the the YouTube attention span, but I think uh, for people interested in this kind of thing, it should be okay. Hopefully I'm not too boring. Uh, it's kind of hard to talk to yourself and play a game and try and concentrate on the game, but it's not a big deal, I guess. Anyway, let's see what we have. So I could play the Europe card and it'd be even. Asia scoring see where we are. Oh, I have six there, so I'm going to play that and get six points right off the bat. Perfect. Then I have to worry about Europe after this, so let's play Headline Asia. Get those six points and see what they play. Headline, oh. So they're going to be able to play seven influence in one one influence is seven different countries in Western Europe. That's bad news, especially since I have the Europe scoring card. I think the AI is cheating. The US is cheating the CIA. Well, he really bumped up Italy. Huh. I do have good cards. You know what? I am going to play this for influence. Let's beef up some influence here in Europe. Um, let's take Turkey. Actually, you know what? Let's take Finland. Let's just grab Finland. Now they're going to get Japanese control, but that's okay because they just played the Asia card. This right here shows you scoring has been played. Next. What will the U.S. do? What do I have for cards? I have a war card here. Could try and get Israel. Be pretty easy. Well, maybe. Hard to say with Egypt right here. But it looks pretty good. Here we go. Where are they cooling? Pakistan. Success. You know what? You can have it. For now. Okay, I need four mil ops. Let's try... Let's try this because I'll get... Uh, I'll get two mil ops for this. So we're going to play the event, which is uh, Invasion of Israel. So let's see if I can get anything in there. I'll get the mil ops too. And... I gained two victory points. Not bad. Didn't get any influence, but what the heck. Alright, US, what are you going to do? Europe. Hmm. CIA. Uh oh, I have to reveal my hand. That's bad. He's going to see my Europe scoring card. And then he put. Influence in Iran, or coup to Iran, okay. Alright. Defcon's at three. We're okay. I need one mil ops. Should I coup? He's going after Iran. He might have Middle East card as possible. Uh, I could wipe out this card. I don't need to. Where we are in Europe here. Can I even get any more influence? I could, I guess. I could play China and try and take France. Um, 
Let's let's three influence from Western Europe, two per country. Yeah, let's play that. Let's play the event. Let's remove one there. One there. One there. Ooh, that's gonna make me think. They're on, they're good on their mill ops. I need one. Let's see what they do. I'm a little worried about... I mean, I have five points right now, but that's going to change. Well, he's going hardcore. I need uh, Middle East. He might have a scoring card. Uh, put it back in West Germany, of course. Might be a good idea to play this. Stalinization. Mm. I can relocate. I don't think I'm going to. I think. Can I coo? Anywhere in Europe? No. Let's not do that. I think I'm just going to play the scoring card. I'm ahead anyway. Let's just play it and get rid of it. I'm not going to get any points, but sometimes it's best just to move on. Let's see what the U.S. does here. So I need to work on probably Africa a little bit. South America. It's got Colombia. I could coup that easily. Uh, blockade. He's going to get rid of a card. It's going to realign. So realignment is similar to a coup. Uh, it doesn't change def DEFCON levels. So if you're at DEFCON 2, you can use realignment rules. Um, and how realignment rules work is based on the ops operational value of the card. Determines how many realignment rules you can make. So... Since this is only one, they only got one chance at realigning. Alright, I need a mill ops. What should I do? I think I'm going to save this for space race. I can do two ops, roll one through four. You had intervention. I can. No, I'm going to save that. That's a good card to have. Let's do uh, place influence. It's going to start working on there in the Middle East here. They're still even. So let's start working on Africa and South America, maybe. Let's put one. I don't really have any inroads into Africa yet. I have Sudan. That's not really where I want to go. I'm kind of limited on my influence, it looks like. So maybe I beef up Iran. Let's beef up the Middle East. Let's uh, let's put another one in Iran. Make them really think hard. Make a tough decision. And let's go back into Egypt, perhaps. Because I think maybe they have the Middle East card. And, and they've got two left no to play. Let's see what happens. I still need a mill ops. But I'm running out of time to get it. I only have one card to play, so I'd have to play it. Uh, I may try. I can hang on to these, but I won't get the space race. Do I give up a victory point for the space race? I think I do. So they gave me Vietnam. Using the influence for... Yeah, I'm guessing they have Middle East. Where are we? I still have three. It's not bad. So either coup or... No, I think I'm going to coup. I'm going to coup uh, Panama or Colombia. Oh my yeah, odds. Bad. How about Colombia? That won't reduce DEFCON, but I have a huge chance. And Columbia is important. 
or Central and South America. It's kind of the linchpin at Panama. So let's let's take Colombia. That should make the U.S. Uh, nervous. Yeah, there it is. Middle East. I get three. That's good. I'm winning. It's amazing. So DEFCON goes back up one. 